uh, lean says since it is not obligatory to be in the state of purity during tawaf and sa'i then how are we going to perform prayers when the adhan is called simply you can go and perform wudu your question with all due respect does not make sense if I prayed Isha and I'm making tawaf and sa'i and we know that you do not have to be in the state of wudu I have no problem but if I prayed maghrib and I'm making my tawaf and sa'i and I'm not in the state of wudu and the adhan of Isha is called how can I pray go and make wudu there's nothing contradicting between the issue of making tawaf and sa'i without being in the state of wudu and between making wudu for prayer these are two separate things and Allah knows best